Welcome to SRPG Plus, it's your guy Kappa Kai. Breaking, breaking, breaking game news. Nintendo Switch 9.0 update. Wow, it took two years, but we got it. You know what we got? The Switch Lite feature on the controllers has finally been patched in, even though it was data mined and shown by hackers over two years ago. We finally had that, so that's extremely hype. Yeah, you can go into your settings and go to notifications and then turn that on and it'll show either during games or you can turn that off and you can customize it. Also, the stylus has been heavily improved. They actually added touchscreen sensitivity options including a stylus, which seems like it's going to be a uh, good for Switch Lite users because they only have the touchscreen or their regular controls connected to the controller. They also had specific Switch Lite stuff which I obviously can't check out until that comes out, which I, I'm still thinking about getting one. And wow, we, we really got it. Nintendo Switch friend invites just through the UI itself, not in the, like actually going through your menu and going to your friends and inviting them to the game. I don't know why it took so long, but we, we finally got it. They also added a fetch with QR code, which seems like it's going to have a uh, use with events with Nintendo, like my Nintendo Rewards program stuff, like a meeting at specific uh, events, like at Best Buy, or specific stores to find rewards for game. And last, there were more features added to the new section. They let you search by name. Uh, it doesn't really seem like it's working now, but it probably will later. And you can also search by wallet accounts. It kind of cleaned up the interface for that. And I thought that was cool because I actually do use the news section. Well, this was you got a cat. Just wanted to drop this real quick video. Breaking news 9.0 is here. Invites, the blue light, they're both here. It's hype. Peace.